The west side of Cincinnati is well known for its tight-knit families, Roman Catholic parish festivals, softball, and chili parlors. But it's never been seen as a hot spot for housing in the tri-state. Until now, on the Business Courier front page centerpiece this week, builders are writing a new west side story. A building boom has quietly been underway in the western half of Hamilton County for the past couple of years. These photos are from Greenshire Commons development. The Business Courier analyzed home building permits and announced developments to deter, determine rather the number of houses coming to this portion of Hamilton County. At least 14 residential communities with about 2,000 single-family homes are in pre-development or underway west of I-75. The main reason has a familiar ring location, location, location on it with the highway accessibility, the retail, the conveniences, you know, the school district being a blue chip school district. And we've got a group of builders that are, you know, offering a product, you know, anywhere from the move up buyer to the custom buyer to the empty nester on it and the diversification on it in this community. Um, it's just been tremendous. The National Association of Home Builders says home building provides an economic boost and is a sign of a healthy economy. The estimated one-year impact of building 100 single-family homes is $28.7 million in income, $3.6 million in taxes and other revenue, and nearly 400 jobs. Business Courier reporter Tom Demeropoulos researched and wrote this story and joins fellow West Side native and U.S. Bank Business Watch producer Kelly Leon in the studio with more. Tom and Kelly. Thanks, Peg. Tom, thanks for being here. I love hearing good news about the West Side because we're, we're both West Me Siders. Me too, yeah. Yes. It's, it's good news. <laughs> what prompted you to look into this story in the first place? Well, there were a couple things, Kelly, that, that came up. So as, as you, you know, we kind of look back over stories we've written through the year and we noticed kind of this trend of new developments being announced on the West Side. And uh, my managing editor said, why don't you kind of take a look at this? And then as a West Side resident, I'd see all the home building activity as I drive yeah. through kind of into town. I thought, maybe there is a story here. So we started adding up all the different communities and how many homes are being built and we got to this big number of, of 2,000 homes in 14 communities at least 14 communities that are that are underway that's fantastic it is so you in the story talked to several home buyers Tell me about the home buyer. Are these traditional West Side folks who've lived there forever? Are these new people coming into town? Who's buying up on the West Side? Yeah, it, it was really a mix, uh, and that was really interesting to, to see how many different people were looking at buying new homes on the West Side. So a couple of the buyers had lived in other places. They had lived in Texas, and they lived in Florida. They'd been out to California, uh, but they had moved back to Cincinnati. And when they moved to Cincinnati, uh, they had lived in different parts of town, downtown or Norwood, but they were kind of craving that West Side community. They wanted to get yeah. back to the west side um, and that's kind of what the west side is known for that tight-knit family um, uh, you know your neighbors yeah uh, and that's that's what they were that's what they were craving yeah I, I can still pretty much tell you where all of my um, grade school classmates <laughs> lived and their, your, their parents probably still live there so what does this mean for the future of the west side yeah, so, you know, with this many homes being built uh, and this many families moving in, uh, it means growth. It means uh, opportunity for additional retail development, uh, new restaurants, uh, potentially more office development. As you have more people kind of filling in on the west side of town, uh, I think you'll see a lot of development follow that as well, kind of on the commercial side. Mm -hmm. And how are the folks that that have traditionally stayed on the west side, how are they responding to this? Are they welcoming all this new development? And well, new it's, it's been interesting. One of the things that, that I wrote about in the story is that uh, longtime west side home buyers are kind of looking for new homes as they don't want to take care of the big yard and they don't yeah. want to take care of the big house. So they're kind of downsizing, but they're trying to do that in place. So one of the developments, Greenshire, has a patio home component and uh, one of the buyers, their, their parents bought a a patio home and they bought one of the new construction single family <laughs> homes so they can walk down the street and be right next to each other. Again, another West Side. Oh, so West Side. <laughs> yes, definitely. Yeah, that's fantastic. Well, great story. Um, be sure to read the, the full story in the print edition. And Tom, thanks for being here this morning. Thanks, Kelly. Back to you.